Welcome back to another episode of Mainly Outdoors. So uh, I just got done uh, hiking and I did some fishing in Katahdin. I decided that I'd stay another night and I didn't have a campground so I went out on the Golden Road and uh, ended up finding a little dirt pit. I've just started a fire up and uh, I'm gonna camp in the back of my pickup tonight. Well, there we go, that's gonna be my bed for tonight. Uh, <laughs> Hopefully it doesn't rain out, I didn't bring a tarp. Uh, but yeah, I'm gonna sleep here tonight, and then tomorrow we're gonna go fishing. Unfortunately, last night I was rudely awoken by a rain shower. So I just decided to get up, make myself some tea, and uh, get going. Let's go. Right now I'm just kinda skimming about, looking at the bottom, seeing how deep it is. Trying to find where that spring is that's feeding this. There's no inlets, there's only an outlet, so this is spring-fed water. Extremely cold, perfect for trout. So this fly, it looks like a mosquito, except it has a little white tuft on its head. It was suggested to me by quite a few people, so I assume they know what they're talking about. Got a little one here, anyway. To start. Nice little brookie. I caught him on the Royal Coach, one of my favorites. This time of year, the fish just aren't biting on the lake midday. I had some bites earlier on, but it slowed down considerably. There's one spot on this stream that has a spring and lots of log cover. And I know for a fact that I'll probably get one there on the first cast. All right, so I'm just gonna walk out on this log and try to balance on it while I fish this hole. You guys watch how many bites I get. Oh, that's the one, that's the one. Get out of the weeds, get out of the weeds. That's a better one. That guy, a lot nicer. Whoa, that's a good one. All right, I almost missed that hook set. That's pretty good for a brook right there. I'm gonna let this one go. If you guys live in Maine and you haven't been to Baxter State Park, you really need to make a trip out here, especially if you love fishing. And if not, even if it's just for hiking, the scenery is gorgeous around here. But to make it a little bit better, there's <laughs> all kinds of fish too. A lot of these lakes are uh, fly fishing only too. So there's usually some pretty healthy populations. See bud? Definitely a fishing hot spot though around here. I mean, there's just so many. The lakes are a little slow, but these streams, <laughs> look at them go. Come on. Oh, it's in your gill. Ah, oh, poor guy. He'll be fine. Oop. As soon as you get it out there though, it's almost guaranteed to get a bite. Oh, I missed him though. Come back. Missed him again. Oh. Something's wrong with my hook. I keep missing him. Maybe I bent it. Oh, wow, that's a big fish. Oh, he's running right at me. I don't have my net. No way. 
I can't believe he's down there. Woo! This is gonna be a tough land. Yes, look at that brook trout. Yes, that's the one I've been after. Such a nice brook trout. Let's go ahead and uh, get the release on him. One more picture. Oh! See you, bud. Actually hiked uh, Knife's Edge too this time for the first time in my life, and man, what a cool hike. You just have giant cliffs on both sides of you. Uh, for us, we were lucky there was no wind. You wouldn't want to do that if it was too breezy. But uh, yeah, there were some tricky spots, but overall, I'd say pretty much anyone could do that. It wasn't terribly difficult. Uh, it wasn't too scary, but I'm not, I don't have a fear of heights, so I, I don't know how to judge that, so. That looks perfect. Yep. That's because it is. He's not bad. Bright color, looks like a native. They don't like being lipped. Whoa, I had a piece of weed on there too. Struggle's real. That's a good fish. Not as fat as the other, but just as long. Oh, don't, come on. Barely hooked. Look at that, Katahdin's visible. Well, there you go, that's what Katahdin looks like. It's the top. Great releases today, always. Just spot on. Look at that, that's what I've been going for all day long. This is why you guys gotta come to Katahdin. Wow. That just made my day. I'm gonna leave it at that. That's gonna be the last fish I caught. Uh, I don't think it gets any better than that in this tiny brook. If it does, I would be I would be absolutely amazed. Unbelievable, this has been such a fun trip and <laughs> that was such a good memory to wrap it up. Uh, I'm really excited about that. So yeah, don't forget to like, subscribe, and leave a comment below and I will see you guys next time.